Hello, hello. Good evening. Hello, teacher. Good evening. How are you? Hello. Welcome back to your classes. Thank you. Okay, well, we're going to wait for the rest of your classmates to come. I hope they will connect soon. How are you? How was your vacation from classes? For me, it's good, Tisha. It was good because yeah. it was like, like one week and something, right? It was like one week without classes. I have no vacations at all. Oh, really? You didn't have vacations? Why? Because I have classes at university, so ah. I don't have any vacation. <laughs> so it was only vacation from English Corporativo, not, not from the classes. Yeah, but yes. Look, but what are you studying? What are you studying, Natalie? I'm studying English too. Oh, yeah. really? Yes. Yay. Another teacher in progress. <laughs> How nice. And where do you study? Where? Uh huh. I study in UMA. At UMA, okay, good, good. That's a very good yeah. university. And if, if you like English, I think any university can be good if you really like what you are studying. So thank you, Natalie, for sharing about that. Sorry that you didn't have any time off from these days that we were not in classes. But it's nice that you are here practicing again. Okay, we are 25 in total. So I hope most of you can connect soon. So welcome to all the to all the students that are just arriving. Welcome to all the ones that are just connecting. It is a great happiness for me to be here with all of you and to have the chance to be serving you in this new module. Are you ready? Are you excited about this new class? Yes, no. A yes, little, teacher. A little bit. <laughs> so I, I don't know if I had the chance to be your teacher before. If I was, let me know. No, I have never been with you, Ray. Let's see. Good evening. Hello, good evening. No, he had the pleasure of being with you before. No, teacher. I think Elmer se me hace bien familiar, yo creo que sí. <laughs> Good evening, teacher. How hello, are you? hello, Elmer, how are you? I'm fine, and you? I am very glad to be here and for sure to see you. <laughs> That's really nice. <laughs> Welcome back. <laughs> Thanks. Okay, well, I, uh -huh. I come back. Again, <laughs> you came back. You see, like, haha, I know, I know him. I <laughs> good, that's so nice. Hello, Byron, Nati, Saul, Marbelli, eh, Ana Julia, Emma, Nelson, Elvia, Patricia, Daisy, Carlos Fernando, Damaris, and Manuel Alejandro. I am going to ask you for a big favor. I need your cameras on during the complete class. That is one thing that I always say. If you are, for example, driving, be very careful, Patri, because I saw that you are on the car. So, but keep the camera on. Why? Because that helps me to keep you in class, right? 
Because when we turn off the camera, we say like, I'm going to put a pijama, I'm going to freeze a egg, I'm going to comer. So it's okay. You can do it with the camera on. But try to be focused on the class. Okay? Yo siempre les pido que me dicen a veces, mire, teacher, voy a cenar aquí rapidito. It's okay. You can do it. Right? No va a dar carita todo, pero anyway. <laughs> But, but you are in class. La idea es que estén en clase, que estén presentes y que podamos compartir, obviamente, eh, esta, esta horita que tenemos juntos nada más. ¿okay? Así que por eso, cuando tenemos la cámara conectada, la diferencia es que la, la distancia es menos. Y puedo, puedo ver que de veras están ustedes enfocados en lo que tienen que estar. Así que eso es, en eso nos ayuda un montón. Y es parte requisito de eh, inglés corporativo que tengamos la cámara encendida durante la clase, que me dice, teacher, pues que aquí se ve desordenado. It's okay. Hasta mucho con que me dejan entrar en su privacidad y pues que me lleguen ahí a las puertas de su casa. Así que eh, les agradecería eso. So, thank you very, very much for being here. Thank you for being connected and on time. And for sure, I am going to be, to start the class, I'm going to present myself to introduce myself with all of you. And you are going to have the chance to tell me a little bit about you. What is the main idea for my class? I need you to produce English, okay? I need you to practice your English. We are going to speak a lot, but I am not the one that is going to speak, is you, right? I am going to make you speak because that is the most important part that you produce the language, that you practice your English, okay? We are going to have fun. We are going to practice. We are going to have a lot of exercises, a lot of homework, a lot of practice. But the main thing that we are going to do is practice, okay? We are going to have group work. We are going to have per work. And we are going to have a lot of interaction. So be ready. Todo lo que no habían hablado quizás antes. Lo van a hablar en este modo. <laughs> Because I make students speak a lot. Si no, aquí no me dejarán mentir los que ya me conocen. You speak a lot <laughs> in these classes. So, but that is the good thing. I, I think that when you are learning English, the most important part of everything is that you practice. Okay? So, uh, without any further ado, I'm going to start the class. Thank you for all the cameras that I can see now. Thank you very, very much. So we are going to be working. This is intermediate three, right? This is our first class. And uh, it is very important to remember that we are going to be working from today, February 27 to March 23rd, okay? We are going to be working on these four weeks from Monday to Thursday, right? Four weeks of practice. and. Today is our first class, and my name is Natalie de Flores, okay? You can call me Teacher Natty, Miss Natty, right? Or whatever way you want, right? I, I really like both ways, Natalie or Natty, it's okay. So, uh, welcome to the class. I am going to talk a little bit about myself and who is the person serving you here at the front, right? This is me, right? This is uh, my profile. I am Evelyn Natalie Monterosa. I am a licenciada in idiom English. I, for sure, I have my licenciatura in idiomas. I have different diplomados in methodologias, leadership, and e-learning. I have studied a lot of different courses of English, didactics, pedagogy, planning, right? I am exactly like you. I am an English expert in progress, right? Exactly like you. Todos estamos como English experts in progress. And I am an INSA4 certified teacher in all the different levels. I have worked in many different places. I have worked for 19 years of my life in teaching. And I have worked in uh, Santa Ana in the Universidad Católica. I also work in Instituto Americano de Idiomas in Santa Ana as a co-founder of the academy. I also work as an interpreter and a translator in Fundación CFCA. I was working there in Santa Ana as well. I worked for 10 years of my life in Programa Empresarial Superate. I have almost two years working with Regal International, that is Inglés Corporativo. I am a principal in an academy in San Salvador as well. Uh, the name of the place is English Learning Center, right? I am the principal in charge there. And I am a Fulbright TEA 
alumni from the American Embassy. This is a program for teachers. It's the Teaching Excellence and Achievement Program from the American Embassy. And I had the chance to, to go to, the, to this scholarship. And I studied there in Arkansas for a couple of uh, months, right? I was there studying and preparing a lot to continue serving you. So this is me. This is uh, the professional that you have at the front. Whatever thing that you need, I will be more than glad to help you. And I am very glad to be your facilitator for this module, right? We are going to be working in different things. I know that you have experience with English corporativo, right? Or is it someone who's, who's it's his or her first day here? ¿Hay alguien que sea su primera vez aquí? Raise your hand. No. No. All of you are experienced English corporativo students, right? Ya tengo seniors aquí. Ya todos vienen experimentados de todos los módulos atrás. Yes. <laughs> okay, good. So that's good. That's good. <laughs> That's good that you that you have the experience of the previous modules, right? Ya conocen la plataforma, sus mañas, sus cosas, sus puntos, sus comas. <laughs> ya les saben ahí todos los trucos a la plataforma. So it is good. It is good that all of you are experienced students, right? That all of you are experienced uh, inglés corporativo students, right? So remember that uh, we need to cover the platform uh, totally before the course finishes. Okay, you know that you can work on the platform on your own pace, right? If you want to finish the platform in the first week, it's okay. If you want to complete everything in a week, it's okay, right? But the idea is that uh, you advance on the platform, okay? That's the, the idea of this, that you advance on the platform as much as possible, right? So, uh, you can work on it as much as you can. Yo creo que todos tienen acceso ya y ya pueden empezar a trabajar en ello. Remember, the WhatsApp group is for you to help each other, okay? If you say like, teacher, I have problems with this exercise and I am going to help you. Or if another student already finished that exercise, you can help. It's not like imagine that I say, hey people, I need help with exercise seven. And Oscar Eduardo already finished. And it's like, ah, si ese bien yuca, ya lo hice. But you don't help the person, right? <laughs> you need to say, hey, this and this and this. This is uh, what I did. It might work for you, right? Help each other. That is very important. Help each other. On the WhatsApp group, I am going to send you different homework, exercise, and practices. And you will say, I teach and más tarea, parte de la plataforma. Yes, sorry. <laughs> because uh, I need you to practice, right? Solo me los prestan 16 días. Les tengo que sacar todo el jugo posible. <laughs> so that's why I need to take advantage of every day. And you are going to say in the morning, Ay, las ocho de la mañana. Ah, ya me voy a escribir de <laughs> And then it's going to be my, good morning. Here's my exercise of the day. Y le voy a mandar ejercicio, le voy a mandar lectura, le voy a mandar tareas, me van a mandar audio. So it's a lot of work. Take advantage of this. Teacher. Uh -huh. Yes, Elvia. And I have a problem with group of the WhatsApp. The WhatsApp group. What happened? You cannot, mm -hmm. you cannot enter. Uh -huh. Okay. Yes. So at the end of the class, you can send me the your number. And I am going to check it to see if we can okay. add you, okay? I can add you. Okay. Or if not, you. Uh, you can answer on the email of Inglés Corporativo and tell mm -hmm. them to add you directly, okay? But send me your, okay. your, your number at the end of the class in a private message, okay? Okay, Zoom. thank you. Here, here in Zoom. Okay, so don't get scared, okay? No se asusten. Yo sé que en nuestros primeros 15 minutos juntos ya los espanté con las tareas. No. Don't get scared, okay? No es un ensayo el que me van a hacer en el día. Son tareas cortas que nos van a ayudar a impulsar nuestro conocimiento del idioma, okay? Lea el diario en inglés ahora. <laughs> no, I'm kidding. No, it's just like, tradúzcame la Biblia. No, I'm kidding. <laughs> What? Hoy en Cuaresma, tradúzcame la Biblia. So, it, it is, they are short, short assessment that I do uh, on the WhatsApp group, okay? 
So uh, we start the class today, February 27. The midterm exams should be done by March 10. Okay. It doesn't mean that you cannot advance uh, before. No, if you finish the platform on this week, there's no problem. But on March 10, I am going to do a checkup for the midterm exams. And on the 21st of March, I am going to do another checkup for the complete platform. Okay, the idea is that we finish before the time. Okay, we need to finish before the class. Tenemos que terminar la plataforma antes que se acabe el módulo. Porque yo, por ejemplo, en lo personal, me gusta que mis alumnos tengan todo listo antes de que el módulo termine. Que no les han diciendo el último día, mire, fulanito, no ha terminado la plataforma, fulanito, sutanito, la plataforma, la plataforma. No. ¿Ok? Yo soy como eso, mamá gallina que anda cuidando. Ya está listo mi grupo, ya termino. No me lo regan. <laughs> Ellos ya terminaron. <laughs> and you'll be, you'll be ready for the 21st of March. So that will be for the platform, right? We are going to check it out a little bit. And let me see the next one. Remember that uh, we need to have your complete name on the platform, okay? I can see that all of you have it, right? All of you have your complete name. Many of you have the camera, right? The camera should be on during the complete session. La cámara tiene que estar encendida durante toda la sesión. So please, I need you to uh, turn it on. I cannot see Patricia, Marlon, Giselle, Saul, Emma. Carlitos, René y Nati. Natalie Flores. Hey, we have another Natalie Flores. <laughs> that's, that's so curious. Okay, so uh, I need your cameras on during the complete class. That's important. Remember, we are going to use the microphone a lot so you can be uh, ready to turn it on. Active participation. I need you to work a lot. I'm going to send you to work in groups, in trios, in couples, right? You are going to participate a lot. That is important. If you need to ask me a question, raise your hand, ya sea en cámara o en, o en, el, en la plataforma. It's okay. And when we send messages, you can do it in Zoom or in the chat of WhatsApp. It's okay. I am pendant of checking both of them. And here, remember that I am going to call the attendance every day and you need to be here the 60 minutes of the class. Why? Because every minute is important. Okay. De repente cuando se hace el contaje, el porcentaje, dicen, mire, ¿por qué tengo yo 42% de porcentaje? Porque nos conectamos un poquito tarde, nos, des nos desconectamos un poquito antes. So, please, the complete hour of the class. You need to be here. I am going to call the attendance and you need to say here or present with your camera on. Okay. I cannot give you permission for the class, but... When you ask for permission in English Corporativo, inform me later, right? But the permission needs to be with English Corporativo, something that it's really, really important. Take advantage of the class, okay? It's not like, ay, que bien oscuro, ahora no me voy a conectar. No, you have to connect to every single class because remember, we are receiving this benefit and we have to take advantage of it. Este es un beneficio, es un regalo que tenemos todos de estar aquí. Y yo les digo que es el que más me alegra, porque son ustedes los que de veras quieren aprender y aquí estoy yo para enseñarles lo poquito que sé. Okay, so it will be a big, big pleasure for me to see you every day, the 60 minutes of the class. Okay, let's continue with the calendar of activities. I am going to send the calendar on the WhatsApp group, but I need you to take notes, okay? Requisito indispensable para la clase, un cuaderno, lapicero. ¿Dónde está? A ver, show it to me. Show me your notebook. Show me your pen, your pencil. Si no tiene, vaya a robarle uno al niño ahí de los que le dieron nuevo. <laughs> There you go. I need you to have a pen and notebook, right? And if you have your manual, and if you can print your manual, you can do it. Si tienen la oportunidad de imprimir el manual, háganlo. Hey, nice agenda, Elizabeth. Si tienen la oportunidad de imprimir el manual, yo siempre les recomiendo que lo hagan. No hay nada mejor que usted pueda ir haciendo sus ejercicios, pueda revisar, pueda volver a leer y todo, si no tiene el PDF a la mano. So, thank you very much for showing me your notebook. The calendar of activities. What days are important? Well, we have four different weeks in this module. 
we have in the first week, that it's this week that we are covering right now, I need you to work on sections one and two, okay, on the platform. This is what I have kind of divided for you. This is not written on stone, okay? Esto no está escrito en piedra. You can advance as much as possible. For, for week number two, it needs to be the section three and the midterm. Section three, sections four and five. And for the fourth week, only the final exams. So that is something that you can calendarize for you to organize yourself with the platform. You can do it different, yes. You can advance more, yes. But this is an idea that I am giving you. I am going to send it to your WhatsApp group as well, okay? Ya se lo voy a enviar a WhatsApp, so don't worry. And you are going to have it there. You can screenshot there too, so that it's another option. You can have a screenshot here. And I am going to send it also on the chat. Here we go. Okay. So here we have, okay. I will send it to your WhatsApp in a second. So you can also have it there. Any question about the calendar that I created for you? Is it okay? Do you consider that it's possible? Yes, no? No teacher, yes teacher. It's okay teacher. It's okay, thank you very much it is. Any other comment, question? Yep. It's okay teacher. Okay, I tried to divide it uh, like in a it's very- It's okay teacher. Thank you, Byron, right? I tried to divide it in a very organized way for you to complete it, right? And for sure, uh, we know the platform very well, right? The platform, it's a very, very good friend of us. And we work on it in a different, uh, in a different way every time. So right now here, I have your attendance here. And on the platform, we have different exercises for every single uh, section, every single unit. And in the platform, you can also find the manual, right? Let me just, it, it's kind of slow today. I don't know what's going on. But on the platform, you can find the manual for the class. Hay una sección arriba en las opciones donde está el manual de estudio and you can download it. De ahí lo pueden bajar. Okay, this is the manual that we're going to be using and you can find it in the platform, right? Let me just refresh this one. Maybe it's going to work. And here you are going to find the different parts of the units that we're going to be working, okay? So once you find it there, ay, this is kind of slow, but you will find it in the platform. If not, I can send it on your WhatsApp as well, but I think most of you have it. ¿Quiénes ya descargaron el manual? Raise your hand. Yep, good. No, teacher. You haven't, okay. So if you haven't downloaded, I'm going to share it with you. And for sure, you can find it on the platform. You can find it on the platform and you can find it in this section right here, okay? So if you go to the platform and it's right here when it says student's manual, you just open it and you can download it. As you can see here, we also have the different sections and the sections, all the exercises that have this little pencil right here are evaluated. So please, I need you to check on the videos and check on the exercises for you to complete, right? And if you have any problem with the platform, let me know as soon as possible, okay? Cualquier problema, por chiquito que sea, comuníquenlo rápido para poderles apoyar de la manera más pronta posible, okay? So this is about the platform and the manual. So let's go back here. And uh, well, the platform, it's a very important part of the module, right? As I told, I have some class agreements, right? Some rules for the class. I really like that we understand each other and that we work together. The first rule of the class, what is it? Help me to read it. What is the first rule of the class? Practice your English as much as possible. Practice your English as much as possible, right? Practice your English as much as possible. What is the second one? 
Ask for help when needed. Ask for help when needed. Right, number three. Keep your cameras on all the time. Number four. Keep microphones off if we are not using them. Exactly right. I love to listen to El Noticiero. <laughs> I love, but in some cases, in some of the houses, it's like, che, teacher, mire, en El Noticiero, la parvea. También comentémosle a nuestra familia lo que estamos haciendo, lo importante de lo que estamos haciendo para que ellos también sean parte de su aprendizaje y les den y les respeten el momento en el que están ustedes. Yo siempre les digo que es importante decirle a los hijos, a la familia, a los que están ahí cerca, hey, bicho, voy a clase. Recuerden, vea, respeten este ratito, es una hora la que les pido. Pero que ahí está el, el hijo viendo ahí, eh, a todo volumen. No, entonces en esto ya vamos a hablar un ratito de, de, de cómo manejamos nuestro espacio de clases. Ya les voy a decir. Number six, uh, no, sorry, number five. Attend. Attend all your sessions on time. Very good. Attend all your sessions on time. I always connect like five minutes before eight, so you can be here early. Number six. Participate Part as much as possible. Participate as much as possible, right? Participate as much as possible. I want to do it. I want to do it. Yay. Participate. Number seven. Keep, keep a cooperative attitude during class. Keep a cooperative attitude during class, right? Keep a cooperative attitude during class. And number eight. Collaborate with your friends on the WhatsApp group. Collaborate with your friends on the WhatsApp group. Very good. And the last one. Practice your speaking every day. Practice your speaking every day. You will say, and, and many of your family members will say like, yeah, when you started with teacher Nati, you got crazy. You speak along. Yeah. It's normal. <laughs> it's normal for you to practice, right? I am going to ask you to record videos. I am going to ask you to record audios. And you are going to do it. You are going to have a lot of reading practice. You are going to practice a lot. So tell your family. No estoy loco. Estoy practicando. <laughs> practice with me, you say. Practice with your family. ¿Alguno de ustedes tiene alguien con quien pueda practicar en su familia? Raise your hand. No? No? Well. Oh, Oscar has. Okay, good. Eh, soy tan bondadosa que hoy le voy a regalar 23 hermanos for you to practice. <laughs> you are going to have all this little family right here for you to practice your English, right? Use the WhatsApp group in English. Try to send the messages in English. Try to send the audios in English, right? Try to practice your English there because that is the only way to practice, right? We don't go outside to El Salvador and say like, oh, hi, Mr. Driver of the Coaster. Here you have my quarter. Have a beautiful day. No, right? You don't go with the lady of the bread on the corner. It's like, hi, Niña Mari. Can you give me one dollar of bread, please? It's like, ¿qué? ¿Qué quiere? <laughs> so take advantage of this moment. Take advantage of this little group and family for you to practice, okay? How to work in the, in the class. Take the best of the virtual class. The first one, participate as much as you can during the class, right? Enjoy that learning moment for yourself. This is your hour, right? This is the time for you to practice your English. What is the second thing that is important? Set your space. Armen su espacio para la clase. Dress nice, but comfortable, right? No se va a poner traje ahí de, de, de gala para venir a clase, pero siempre esté ordenado. Y si se pone pijama, póngase la pijama bonita. Right, but comfortable. Be comfortable in the moment of the class. Okay, no estar en centro ahí o sin camisa. <laughs> Too much skin for the class. Thank you very much. <laughs> the next one, right? Keep your notebook, your pens, and the pencils at hand. Okay, keep your notebook at hand for you to take notes. Take notes and ask questions at the moment of the class. And if I am busy, Send the questions on the chat, okay? Si de repente estoy ocupado o estoy hablando o algo y si tiene una pregunta, mándenle al chat para que no se le olvide, okay? 
Stay away from pets and family that might distract or interrupt you, okay? I know and I have that problem, right? Because I have a dog and she comes to the class and she's like hey, 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 in the middle of the class. Stay away of pets, right? Lo puede tener ahí cerquita, estarlo sobando, pero no en la cámara. <laughs> Mire mi chucho. <laughs> So, stay, because it might interrupt you or distract you from the class. Keep away any device or television that might distract you as well. That you have here the computer and here the cell phone, right? And you are chatting here. And the teacher is talking and you are like, Ajá, teacher, ajá. Sí, luego, teacher, dale, dale, dale. Luego, teacher, dale. Ajá, no, right? Stay focused on what we are doing. So, this is important for you to take the best out of your virtual class. But... A lot of talking for teacher Nati. I am going to call the attendance and we're going to do an activity, okay? I am going to call the attendance. Remember when you listen to your name, say here or present, okay? Let me see. Okay, intermediate three, very good. And I am going to start right here with Ana Julia. Good evening, teacher. Thank you, present, right? Uh, Byron Rafael? Present teacher, good evening. Good evening, Brian Eduardo? Brian Eduardo? One, two, three, one, two, three. No, Brian? Briancito? Okay. Let's see. Carlos Fernando? Present. Thank you. Cristina Abigail. I'm here. Thank you. Abigail is with V or with B? With B of uh, banana or V of uh, base? Abigail, because. V, v uh -huh. or base. Okay, V. Yes. Oh, yes. that's a, that's a, a, the first time that I see it like that. Thank you, Avi. Damaris yes. Merari? Present teacher. Thank you. Daisy Magdalena? Present teacher. Elizabeth del Carmen? Present teacher. Thank you. Elmer Mauricio? Present teacher. Elvia Sofia? Present. Emma Yamilet? Present teacher. Giselle Cecilia. Present teacher. Iris Rosario. Present. Thank you. Uh, Manuel Alejandro. Manuel Alejandro. Marbelli Jocelyn. Present teacher. Marlon Ernesto. Marloncito. Marlon a la una, Marlon a la dos, Marlon a las tres. No está mal. Ok. Natalie Geraldine. Thank you. Let me see. Ok. Marbelli Jocelyn. Yes, right. Present teacher. Thank you, thank you. Eh, Nelson Rolando. I am here, teacher. Oscar Eduardo. Present teacher. Thank you. Pablo Reyes. Present teacher. Patricia Verónica. Present teacher. Thank you. René David. Renécito. Present teacher. Thank you. Thank you. Sandra y Anet. Sandra y Anet. Sandrita. Sandrita. Saúl Arnulfo. Sara María, sorry. Present. Ya, ya, ya me la... Uy, no. Ya la, ya iba a decir, la... no, no, esto, no estoy en este grupo. <laughs> no, 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 sorry, sorry. <laughs> Saúl, Saúl, answer in the chat. Saúl Arnulfo, very good. And uh, Sandra Yanet? No, right, she didn't answer. Sandrita, okay. 
So there you go. I'm missing four students. Yes, I'm missing four. Well, so let's go back here. Thank you very much. Yes. Oh, you and teacher. Yep. Okay. So let's go back here. Okay, let's meet. Uh, let's continue here. We're going to meet the team. Who's my team? You are my team, right? You are my team. You are my students, right? We're going to meet the team and we're going to work a little bit on this one. You are going to work on your student's profile. What is a student's profile? It is for me to know a little bit of who you are and what do you need me to help you with, right? What type of a student you are? What type of a student is the one that it's on the other side of my camera, right? And this is what you are going to tell me. You are going to tell me about you and about what you do, right? You are going to tell me a little bit about your English journey. How long have you been studying English? How long have you been doing this? Where have you studied before? Right. If you learn in, in school, if you learn a, in a different country, if you have the opportunity to travel and you learn English, or if you have been in English Corporativo since the very beginning, right? What you enjoy the most about life and about anything? What is something that you cannot stand? What is something that you need to do to practice your English? Right. And what is something that you need to improve about English? Right. So what it's uh, important things about you and the things that you do. What is your English journey? Right. ¿Cuál ha sido su experiencia con el idioma inglés? ¿Cómo lo ha aprendido? ¿Cuánto tiempo lleva? So I need to know everything. What do you enjoy the most about the classes, about the life, about anything? Right. What is something that you can't stand? What is something that you don't like? Right. About life and about the classes as well. What do I do to practice? ¿Qué haces para practicar? So think about that and I need you to tell me. And what do you need to improve? What do you need to improve about the English language? So please, I am going to give you a couple of minutes for you to write down some ideas. Write down some ideas for your answers. And then you are going to share the answers with me. Okay, so this is, these are the like kind of the, the guide for the questions. and. This is what you are going to write down on your notebook. If I give you the example, I will say, well, I am Natalie de Flores. I am an English teacher, right? That's what I do. I teach English and I have done this for 19 years of my life. My English journey, I learned English when I was nine years old, right? When I was very little, right? And I have been learning since then, right? I have almost what 19 years of my life learning English <laughs> and uh, I studied English right and I work with English what is something that I enjoy the most I enjoy speaking in public I love speaking in public right what is something that I cannot stand I cannot stand laziness right I cannot stand being late right que la gente llegue tarde. I hate that I cannot stand it what do I do to practice? I teach, I watch videos, I listen to music in English, I sing in English, I watch movies, I, I practice with my husband, with my students, with my friends. And what do I need to improve? I need to improve um, what? My, um, my writing, I can say, no, I, I, I don't have problems with that. <laughs> what do you need to improve? My interaction, right? I need to practice more. So those are the answers that you can give me. Write down your answers on your notebook. And when you have them ready, raise your hand for me to know that you finish. Cuando terminen de escribir sus ideas en su cuaderno, levante la mano para saber que ya terminaron. Okay? So write down your answers, please. And if you have any question, let me know. Si tienen alguna duda o si no comprendemos qué es lo que tenemos que hacer, tell me. This is about you, remember.
Okay, when you finish writing your ideas, raise your hand on the platform so I can know that you have finished. Dejen la manita levantada para que yo sepa que ya terminaron. Did you finish? No, teacher. Okay, Cristina, finish already. Good. Leave, leave your hand up. Ahí déjeme la manita levantada para que. Okay, we're going to start sharing. And maybe we're not going to do it perfectly. Oscar, did you finish? Yes, I finished. Okay, good. We're going to work on that right now. So I am going to send you to work in, in well, it's not in couples, in trios. And we're going to share a little bit for you to practice. And then we're going to come back and share it with the group, okay? So that's the first thing that we're going to do so we can have the chance to actually meet each other a little bit. I know that you maybe know each other a lot, but uh, we are going to start with that. We're going to do it in groups and you are going to share your answers, right? Very, very small groups for you to practice. And then I am going to bring you back. Okay, we're going to practice in mini groups first, and then we are going to work together. You are going to receive an invitation to go to the group, and we are going to do it. Let me see. Okay, and here. Okay. There you go. 
you are going to receive an invitation for you to join the group and you are going to give your answers to the group. Okay, I am going to be you to be visiting you in the different rooms. So please accept my invitation. I have a couple of you in the groups already. Thank you very much. Accept my invitation and I need you to practice with the group. Okay to present yourself, to introduce yourself, and to give your answers. And then I'm going to bring you here for you to practice with me. Okay, Patti, Rene, Nati, Emma, Saul, Damaris, and Elmer, accept my invitation, please. Thank you, thank you. Saúl, Damaris y Patti, ¿les llegó mi invitación? Elvia, ¿te llegó mi invitación? Teacher, ¿Ya? Eh, cuando intento entrar, me saca solita otra vez del grupo y me manda para acá. Ok, voy. <laughs> I, will, I will send you to a different group. Okay. Let's see. I will send you to this group. Try. Okay, Patti, I will send you the invitation right now. There you go. Mire si le llegó, yes. Patti. Okay, good. Yes. yes. Elmer, te llegó la invitación, Elmer. Saúl, te llegó la invitación, Damaris. Sí, me llegó pero no me no se logró meter al grupo. Ok, ahorita te pongo en otro. There you go. Saúl, te llegó la invitación. Hola, Saúl. Saulito, te llegó la invitación. Hola, Saúl. Ah, sorry. <laughs> Perdón, no había leído el chat. Ok, Saúl, don't worry. I am going to go and check the groups. Voy a ir a los grupos y ya vuelvo, ok? Sorry, sorry, I haven't checked. Sorry. Here we go. Hi. Who's, who's starting? ¿Quién empezó? Voy a terminar. No. <laughs> ok. No. Ok. Eh, Carlito Fernando, ese problema que tiene con la cámara es una actualización de Zoom. Tienen que actualizarlo. Ya, yeah. okay, yo, te, yeah. yo tenía el mismo problema. Don't worry. Era bien Thank interactiva you. la clase. <laughs> Go ahead, Elizabeth. Ok. I'm an accountant and my, engl my English journey started uh, one year ago. What I, I what I enjoy the most, I really enjoy to travel in other countries. What I can cannot stand, I hate working under pressure. What do I do to practice? I listen to English music and I see two videos in YouTube. Uh, what I need to improve. I speak to my coworker. So you need to improve your speaking, huh? That's good, good. Excellent, yeah. Elizabeth, thank you. Byron, go ahead. Okay. I begin studying 
English one year ago. I really enjoyed traveling to Costa Rica. I hate arrive very late. Me too. <laughs> Me too. Don't worry. And <laughs> I am listening music in English and I am speaking with my friends. Okay. And what do you need to improve? <laughs> I improve. ¿Qué necesitas mejorar? How do you say? <clears throat> How do you say? My, pronunci my pronunciation. Okay, my pronunciation. Good, you need to improve your okay. pronunciation. Good, okay. very good. Excellent. Who's okay. next? René David. Thanks. You're welcome. Sir. Okay, good evening. Good evening. Uh, me and what I do. I am René David Calderon and I am I am looking to to learn English. And my English journey. I studied English in, in the school, but I never liked it. Uh, but when I started working, uh, I realized uh, how important it is to speak uh, other language, and especially the, the English. Uh, what I enjoy the most, I enjoy to, to communicate to other people. What I cannot stand, I can't stand the traffic in the morning. What do I what do I do to practice? Uh, I watch movies in English, I speak with other people, and listen music in English. Excellent. Uh, what what do I never uh, what do I need to improve? Um, I need to improve my vocabulary and my safety safety when, when I speak. Okay, my confidence. Is it? My, my confidence. confidence. Okay, my confidence at the moment of speaking. Good, very good. Carlos Fernando. I would like to travel to Peru. Uh -huh. uh, uh, well, I cannot uh, stand the traffic. Everybody, um, we hate. <laughs> uh, <laughs> Uh, what and um, you to Mox watch movies in English? Um, what do I need to improve my vocabulary and pronunciation? Okay, your vocabulary and pronunciation. What is the best way to improve vocabulary? Practicing your English all the time. <laughs> Do the challenge, right? Do the challenge. You say, I am not going to speak Spanish anymore. And practice your English. Even in the hour of the class or something, try to do it, right? Try to do it. I will have a good, a new friend here and I will go and check the other classmates, okay? I will come back. Very, very difficult. Say yes. Why do you keep silence? <laughs> you were like ta 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 ta, and I enter. Teacher, estamos hablando sobre uh, my my English journey. It's okay. Uh, it's okay. Very 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 difficult. Mm -hmm. Very difficult. Yeah. Well, uh -huh. you you have been you have been studying for one year, right? Um, you have been here for one year, right? Mm -hmm. In, in yes, English corporativo. Yes. 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 But yes. this is a good moment and in some cases some students say like hey, yes how much time I have wasted right este es el momento para que se den cuenta y digan cuánto he aprovechado el año practicing <laughs> practicing investigating reading listening speaking ajá sí se ve que <laughs> yo trato pero es que a veces Cuando uno trabaja todo el día, cuesta un poquito. Porque... I know, I know. Ay, mire, yo, 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 listen music, pero. Ok. No se me queda. No, I know. So we need to change. We need to change the chip a little bit. And to say like, ok, 
for lunch, ¿cuánto tienen de almuerzo normalmente en su trabajo? Um, one hour. One hour. One hour. Dedicate 10 minutes every day. Not one hour. 10 minutes. To read grammar, to check vocabulary, to listen to audios, to listen to English uh, recordings, and you will see the difference. 10 minutes. Si de repente en el bus va ahí, ay, qué, qué, qué aburrido el tráfico. Put some English conversations in YouTube. Pon unas conversaciones en inglés ahí, en YouTube. And listen to them, right? The idea is to change. Little changes are going to make a big difference. Little changes are going to make a big difference. Ahí si sus amigos le dicen, ¿qué andas oyendo? English, audios, grammar, vocabulary. You will see the difference. You will see. Because imagine you have one year here. One year on this journey. So it's it's complicated. I know. I know it's difficult. But it requires a lot of discipline. It requires discipline. Okay. We're going to go back because I need to give some, uh, some pieces of advice. Okay. Let's go back to the main session. Welcome back. Aha. Uh -huh. Was it easy to interact with your friends? It was easy to produce the English to answer these very simple questions? Fue fácil para ustedes contestar esas preguntas así fluido? It's difficult. It is difficult. And you know, the curious thing is that you have one year studying English. Yeah. So, this is our first day together, right? And this is just an example of what comes, right? This is just a little example of what you are going to be doing. I am going to push you to your limits of practice, okay? Ahí lo voy a ir empujando y sacándolo de la zona de confort para que sí se pongan las pilas y practiquen. So, I need, I need one volunteer that you say, no, teacher, this is easy for me. I can do it. Uh -huh. So you can help me. Patricia, Veronica, let's, let's see. Vamos, Patricia. Pati, pati, pati. Go. Eh, teacher, Ajá. Estoy un poquito desubicada, pero ahorita le contesto. Hello, Patricia. Welcome to the class. Okay. I told you. I told you that we were answering a couple of questions, right? Estamos respondiendo esta parte, right? And it is... Okay. It is in some cases complicated. It is a little bit complicated to find the answers, but you practice a little bit today. Hoy practicaron un poquito, ¿eh? darme una respuesta, pero quizás no era la respuesta que ustedes me querían haber dado. Es así como yo, yo quisiera haber incluido más, o sea, yo quisiera haberlo hecho mejor. So I am going to give you the chance for you to polish your answer. Okay? Pulan esta respuesta para mañana. And tomorrow you are going to say, hi, teacher, how are you? My name is Natalie. I am a teacher. I have studied English for 20 years and I really love doing this and that, blah, blah. And I need a fluent answer. Okay. I need a very, very fluid answer for tomorrow. Okay. Practice. Practice the answer for tomorrow. Practiquenme esa respuesta para todo este parrafito que tenemos aquí. ¿Quién eres? ¿Qué es lo que haces? ¿Cuánto has estado aprendiendo inglés? ¿Qué es lo que más te gusta? ¿Qué es lo que no te gusta? ¿Qué es lo que haces para practicar? ¿Qué es lo que tenés que mejorar? So, in English, for sure. And I need you to practice your answer. Okay? Y mañana me lo cuentan como que se lo estuvieran contando algún amigo. Me dice, teacher, I am Oscar Eduardo. I do this and this. Teacher, I am Sara María. I do this and this and this. Right? I like this. I don't like this. And blah, blah, blah. So I will give you the chance for you to practice for tomorrow, okay? And bring me your answer. Bring me your answer for tomorrow. Practice, practice, and practice. This is the first activity we are going to do in class, okay? Mañana tan pronto nos conectemos, le voy a empezar a agarrar uno por uno. Vamos, Byron, preséntese. Vamos, René, preséntese. Vamos, Sara, preséntese. Mañana, al nomás entrar a la clase. No se van a correr, vea, porque todos lo vamos a hacer y vamos a practicar, vamos a pulir esas respuestas. Okay, we are going to do it good. If you have questions, use the group. 
If you have a doubts of pronunciation, send me a message. Teacher, ¿cómo decimos eso en inglés? And I will help you, okay? That will be the homework for tomorrow. Have your answer ready, okay? Deal? Tenemos un trato para mañana? Yes? So, practice. Yes, teacher. Practice yes, your answer. Yes, practice yes, your answer. Yes, and yes. I'm going to see you tomorrow, okay? Have a wonderful night. It was a big pleasure to meet you. And I'm going to see you tomorrow for the next class. Have a beautiful night. Thank you. Thank you. See you tomorrow. Practice. Thank you, teacher. Thank you, teacher. Bye-bye. Practice your answers. Bye-bye.